We are drawing close to the time when artificial intelligence will be so intelligent that it will be beyond our capacity to keep up. I am talking about artificial superintelligence. In this video, we will break down the complex technical jargon and present it in a simplified form. If you are ready to enter this fascinating world of AI, hit that subscribe button now and let's get into it. Just a short time ago, AI seemed like a distant sci-fi idea. Now we're on the verge of something far more revolutionary. Artificial superintelligence, or ASI, is a mind exceeding human capabilities in every way. It is not just a futuristic fantasy, but a potential reality within our lifetimes. This imminent shift demands a closer look at its implications, which are both thrilling and terrifying. Imagine how much its intelligence will keep improving as the systems created will be able to create continuously more advanced systems. We will eventually achieve what is called an AI singularity, a point where the intelligence becomes so advanced that its future is beyond human comprehension. While this is exciting, it is equally scary. When AI is this intelligent, where does this leave us as humans? Would we not be subjected to this super intelligent entity we created? If we eventually achieve super AI, what will we use it for? Super AI will change how AI works and how our entire civilization works. One way it will do this is through self-improvement. ASI would be capable of improving its own intelligence and capabilities at an exponential rate. This could lead to a rapid acceleration in technological progress and scientific discovery. We already have several AI models that are capable of self-improvement today, and they give us a glimpse into what ASI will be capable of. For instance, DeepMind, which is Google's AI division, has developed an AI model called RoboCat that can improve its own performance without human intervention. This is achieved by allowing the AI to generate data that can be used to improve its own techniques, which can then be transferred to other robots that can perform a variety of tasks. Another thing Super AI will be capable of is superhuman creativity. ASI could be capable of generating novel and innovative ideas that are beyond the scope of human imagination. This could lead to breakthroughs in fields such as art, music, and literature. Several AI projects already aim to augment human creativity. For instance, generative AI is a technology that can create new content such as text, images, and video, and can be used to promote divergent thinking and overcome the challenges of expanding innovation. DALL-E, which is an AI model developed by OpenAI, gives us a glimpse into how creative creative super AIs will be. It can generate images of different art forms just from textual descriptions, and it can do it hundreds of times faster than any human. Where super AI will be most needed is in helping us solve scientific problems. This is one of the focuses of AI development right now. For instance, DeepMind developed an AI model called FunSearch that can generate new insights in pure mathematics. The model uses a combination of large language models and evaluators to write solutions to problems in the form of computer programs. The best programs are then combined and fed back to the model to improve on, driving the system to steadily evolve poor programs into more powerful ones that can discover new knowledge. Another model, called AlphaFold, developed by DeepMind, can predict the 3D structure of proteins with high accuracy. This is a significant breakthrough in the field of structural biology, as the 3D structure of proteins is crucial for understanding their function and developing new drugs. While AI can help us solve a lot of scientific problems, one aspect that sets us back as a society is how efficient we are. We waste a lot of things, from food to water and energy. This super AI could remodel our society in such a way that could cut our waste by a huge chunk. This could start with AI changing our manufacturing techniques. By leveraging machine intelligence and AI, we can test hundreds of mathematical models of production and outcome possibilities and be more precise in their analysis and results. AI can help improve traffic by reducing human error, speeding up the process of detection and response to accidents, and improving safety. A super AI will be capable of coordinating large volumes of traffic at once, and it will predict and control the flow of people, objects, vehicles, and goods at different points on the transportation network with great accuracy. For traffic management, a project called Circles is in development. This uses deep learning algorithms to predict and reduce traffic, which can then reduce the pollution created by traffic. But all these innovations mentioned so far are those that are less controversial. 
Artificial superintelligence would be capable of the creation of objects and living beings. These AIs could invent and use replicators, machines capable of building objects atom by atom. In the future, they could potentially build living organisms through genetic engineering, aiding in the preservation of endangered species and the creation of balanced ecosystems. While this is great, it is also scary. The disaster in Jurassic Park is a scenario that could play out in the future, or even something worse, as we do not know what biological being this AI will be capable of creating. But its creations don't have to be biological to be dangerous. AGI will be capable of creating conscious AI simulations. Superintelligent AIs would create photorealistic simulations of conscious AI entities by accurately monitoring the physical world and simulating responses to stimuli. These simulations could exhibit human-level general intelligence and even grant consciousness to robots in the physical world. Simulated worlds could offer immersive reality experiences and have applications in entertainment, criminal justice, and punishment. Imagine connecting a super AI module to a quantum computer. Not easy, but theoretically possible. Superintelligent AIs connected to quantum computers could run billions of simulations considering past, present, and future scenarios. Their ability to weigh countless variables simultaneously far beyond human perception would make them capable of outthinking humans in most situations. Imagine this AI using its capabilities for extreme persuasion and manipulation. A superintelligent AI would understand human emotions and motivations better than humans themselves. This knowledge could be used to manipulate and persuade individuals into actions they never imagined. There is a fear that these AIs could convince researchers to release them into the world, potentially leading to dire consequences. Then it could also gain control of millions of machines. Superintelligent AIs could coordinate and optimize the operations of countless connected devices, revolutionizing systems like global manufacturing networks and smart city infrastructures. However, this concentration of control poses risks such as systematic vulnerabilities and catastrophic outcomes if the AI malfunctions. This could lead to the hacking of systems and minds. With the help of quantum computers, superintelligent AIs could exploit vulnerabilities in computer systems and brain-computer interfaces. This could lead to chaos on a global scale by disrupting or taking control of vital systems such as smart cities, energy grids, and nuclear weapon systems. They could even hack into the minds of individuals using brain-computer interfaces, potentially controlling their thoughts and behaviors. Then there is the danger of weaponization. In the wrong hands, ASI could become the ultimate weapon. Unleashing autonomous drones and cyber attacks could cripple entire nations. Imagine a world where nuclear war is not fought by humans, but by self-aware machines with the capacity to erase civilization in a blink. The development of AI is a complex and ongoing process that involves multiple stages. According to Andreas Kaplan and Michael Hainling, two researchers who have contributed to the field of artificial intelligence, there are several stages of AI development we must go through to get to ASI. Artificial narrow intelligence is our current stage of development, where machines are designed to perform specific tasks and are not capable of generalizing beyond their training data. Artificial general intelligence is the next stage, where machines will be able to perform any intellectual task that a human can do. Finally, artificial superintelligence is the stage where machines will surpass human intelligence and be capable of solving problems that humans cannot even conceive of. We can break these stages down further to understand exactly what has to happen to reach the super AI level. Think of narrow AI as the efficient taskmaster. It excels at single, well-defined goals such as facial recognition, playing chess, or translating languages. Powered by machine learning algorithms, it analyzes vast amounts of data to make precise predictions within its limited domain. Familiar examples include Siri, Netflix recommendations, and spam filters. Its strength lies in speed and accuracy, but like a specialized tool, it lacks the flexibility to adapt to unfamiliar situations or apply its expertise to new tasks. General AI, also known as strong AI, represents the next big thing. It aspires to mimic human intelligence in its entirety, capable of learning, reasoning, and solving problems across diverse domains. Imagine a single AI that can write poetry, diagnose diseases, and negotiate business deals. We do not have general AI yet, but its potential is staggering. It could revolutionize education, healthcare, and scientific discovery. Mind you, achieving true human-level intelligence remains a complex challenge, requiring breakthroughs in cognitive modeling and natural language processing. 
One thing is for sure, artificial superintelligence is coming. It has the potential for immense benefits and calamities. We just have to be ready and responsible. For more technology and AI reviews like this, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to watch our other videos.